Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this tutorial, we are going to see, how to create, simple character introduction intro animation in After Effects, so without any wait, let's see the preview. To create this intro, you can use your image or video, here I am going to demonstrate this, using an image file, so without any wait, let's start creating our intro. Let's create a new composition. Name it as intro. Make sure to set the frame rate to 30 frames per second. Let's set the time duration to 5 seconds. Now let's create a new solid. This will be our background. Now in effects and preset. Search for amp. Add it to background solid layer. Now change the start and end color for amp as shown. Now let's add our media file to timeline. Here I will scale my image file to fit the composition. I will slightly adjust the position of my image file. Perfect. Now let's recompose the image file. Name it as media. Now select the ellipse tool. Now draw mask over the media composition as shown. Perfect. Now for mask 1. Let's adjust mask feather. Perfect. Now adjust the mask expansion value. Perfect. Now create a new solid. Name it as noise. Change solid color to white. Now for noise solid layer, create mask as shown. Perfect. Now go up 2 seconds and 15 frames. Now create a keyframe for mask path. Now come back to start of the timeline. Now adjust the mask path as shown. Now you can see the preview. Perfect. Now let's adjust the mask feather, set it to near about 350. Now in effects and preset, search for rough edges. Add it to the noise layer. Now for rough and edges, change scale value to near about 190. Slightly adjust the edge sharpness. Let's slightly adjust the border value. Perfect. Now for media composition. Change track mat to luma mat noise. Perfect, now let's see the preview. Perfect. 
Now let's create a new adjustment layer. Now draw mask for adjustment layer is shown. Perfect. Now in effects and preset, search for curves. Add it to the adjustment layer. Now slightly adjust the curves. Perfect. Now in effects and preset, search for fast blur. Add it to adjustment layer. Change blurriness value to 1. Select repeat edge pixel. Now for mask 1, change mode to subtract. Now for mask 1, adjust the mask feather as shown. Perfect. Now let's add our text. Here I am using Nexa font family. Let's align the text to center. Now let's animate our text. Now in text. Go to more options. Change grouping alignment for Y axis to near about minus 30. Now from animate, select tracking. Now in range select a 1. Go to advance. Change units to index. Now come back to one second. Now create a keyframe for offset. Now change offset value to near about 37. Now go at 4 seconds. Change offset value to minus 25. Now select created keyframe. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now adjust the speed graph as shown. Now change shape to ramp down. Now change easy low value to 100%. Now change randomize order to on. Now for animator 1. From add select property, opacity. Change opacity value to 0%. Now add property, scale. Change scale value to near about 300%. Now add property, blur. Change blur value to near about 80. Now for text layer, again add tracking. Now come back to start of the timeline. Create a keyframe for tracking. Now go at end of the timeline. Change tracking amount to near about 20. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now let's pre-compose the text layer. Name it as text. For text composition. In effects and preset search for ramp. Add it to text composition. Now change start and end color of ramp as shown.
Now search for Bevel Alpha. Add it to text composition. For Bevel Alpha, change edge thickness to 3.80. Now in effects and preset. Search for Glow. Add it to text composition. Now for Glow, change Glow Threshold to 84%. Change Glow Radius to 40. Change Glow Color to Color A and B. Change B Color to White. Change Glow Operation to Normal. Now in Effects and Preset. Search for Curves. Add it to Text Composition. Now you need to adjust the curves as shown. Perfect. Now in effects and preset, search for sharpen. Add it to text composition. Change sharpen amount to 11. Now in effects and preset. Search for CC light sweep. Add it to text composition. Now add 3 seconds. Now create a keyframe for the center. Now position the center as shown. Now go at 4 seconds and 16 frames. Change position of the center as shown. Change sweep intensity to 50. Press S to bring up the scales. Now let's scale the text composition. Now adjust the position for text composition. Perfect. Now change media composition, noise layer and text composition to 3D. Now let's create a camera layer. Now come back to start of the timeline. Now for camera press P to bring up the position. Now change position for Z axis as shown. Now go to end of the timeline. Change position for Z axis as shown. Perfect. Now create a new solid layer. Now change color to black. Name it as the frame. Now draw mask as shown. For mask 1, change mode to subtract. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Here you can set background color according to your media file, or you can also remove the background layer. Here our character introduction intro animation tutorial is complete. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, then make sure to like and share this video, and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.